Hello, it's me. <laughs> wouldn't, wouldn't you guys like to have something that you could like, you know, amplify your music with and make it louder? Because this isn't very loud. Hello. Okay, I'll stop. I promise. Okay. I know you guys miss me singing in class. So, uh, yeah. So, um, I have a cool idea for this week's project. And I'm really excited about it. We are going to be making clay cell phone amplifiers. Woo! Okay. So, for this project, I'm not doing a step-by-step -step demonstration. Because there's so many different ways that you could actually complete this. I think the best method for you guys is going to be to look at different projects and decide how you want to construct this piece yourself. Okay. So I'm going to show you some examples. I'm going to show you the handout I'm going to give you. And um, then you guys are going to go from there. Okay. And obviously ask me if you have any questions. Um, but this is a pretty straightforward assignment. Okay. So cell phone amplifier. Everybody knows that if you take a bowl or a mug or something like that, okay, I put this mug and I play my good, good old Adele song here or, or one Republic, whatever. Okay. So we all hear it, but it's so much louder in the pop. Okay, so Riley, I totally am using your slab, beautiful slab base. Look at Riley's beautiful slab base that she dropped off at school to have me fire. This is a great example too. So if I turn my music back on, let's get a rant, let's get it going. Let's get it going. Okay. I'm going to put it in Riley's pot. So, um, pots can make things a little bit louder. We can amplify things. So what I've done is I found all of these Riley good pots. Um, I found all of these um, different examples of pieces that we could be looking at um, and how to actually construct your piece. Okay. So I am going to switch my screen. You're not going to see my face anymore. Okay. So I'm going to switch my screen and I'm going to show you some examples that I found online. So here is your cell phone amplifier assignment. Um, and this assignment, it says, for this assignment, you will each be creating a cell phone amplifier. This can be constructed in many different ways. You could choose to make a slab piece, coil piece, or mold. You may also use a combination of these methods as well. You may create yours to be a simple piece, or you can add generation and decoration and creativity. In the space below, please sketch an initial plan for your iPhone amplifier project, or it doesn't have to be an iPhone, I guess. I just accidentally said that. <clears throat> Including decorative themes, textures, and designs. Please also list the specific construction details that you're going to use to create this piece. Now, what, what's going to be interesting is, oh, and then I have um, this little space for you guys to draw in. And then it says, how will you construct this piece? Coil, pinch, wheel. Obviously, you're not going to use wheel. So let's take that out. Coil, pinch, mold. Okay. So um, there's different things that you could do there for how you make it. Um, you could also do slab. Okay. Um, what kind of texture or decoration do you plan on using? If you're going to add something to it and where are you going to place the cell phone? So I don't want it to be just like the pots that you saw me with because those are just normal pots. They're not cell phone amplifiers. So what's the difference between a pot and a cell phone amplifier? Look at this. This is so much fun. So there's tons of different cool designs that you guys can make. I freaking love the monsters. I think those are so cool. Um, and there's all these different types of amplifiers. So there's like a traditional kind of megaphone amplifier that you see up there on the left. 
um, and right here in the yellow, and then you've got this really cool guy that kind of like looks like really cool, and then you have this cool little monster, you've got these guys with like the funny faces and then the open mouths, so that's where like the sound would come out of, that's kind of cool. Um, this looks like a squished seashell or something. Um, here we have like this pot initially was probably thrown on the wheel and then it, they just cut a hole into the top where the cell phone would slide in and then it would amplify that way, which is really cool. Um, that's kind of the piece I'm thinking that we're going to go with. So if you look at a lot of these, I love this monster, super cute. Um, and then this guy right here, again, wheel thrown pot with um, a little slit just cut into the side to fit the phone in and then it just kind of produces the sound. This one's a little bit more of a wider bowl to amplify the sound. Um, and then we've got some other examples. Again, cute little monster. Um, and then we have this little speaker guy here um, and another monster because I love those. And then this, I love this one. This is like a little, um, just like a little cup with like a little face in it. And he just sticks the cell phone in the mouth. Ha <laughs> oh, ha, funny. Uh, and then this one's really cool. Um, it looks, so almost looks like a kind of like a organic kind of whale shape-ish thing. Okay. So what this is going to, what you're going to do is you are going to decide how you are going to make this piece. So this is going to be a lot of creativity, a lot of artistic freedom within this specific piece. Um, I've been very step-by-step. Uh, -step with your DLD days assignments. And I wanted to give you guys a little bit more freedom and not have a step-by-step -step assignment, but have you guys have options of how you want to create this piece. So you could, so let's come up with some ideas of different ways that you could do this piece, okay? So you could create um, a slab mold like we did with the flower pots last week you could do that and almost squish one side down and then cut a slit in the other side for the cell phone, okay? Um, you could just make a mold of a cup or a bowl and then just cut into one side. You could make uh, a coil pot and um, you could make a pinch, giant pinch pot. I mean, there's so many different ways that you can do this. Now, you do not have to make a cool monster or a cool face or anything like that, okay? It's, this assignment is just to create the amplifier system, okay? Uh, whether you decide to decorate that and do a little bit more and make it look really cool or not is up to you, okay? So um, this is going to be very similar again to last week's assignment. You could do a mold and then you could just kind of straighten it or like um, push it down a little bit and then cut a hole into the top. Now, a reminder, clay shrinks. When clay dries, it shrinks. So if you're cutting a hole to fit your cell phone in it, you must make sure that it's actually bigger than your cell phone, okay? Because um, you do not want your cell phone to not be able to fit, okay? Again, it is totally optional whether you guys want to fire these and, um, and keep them, although I totally would because this is a really cool assignment. I've never done it and I've always wanted to. So, um, so this is, if you want to keep these assignments, let them dry out bring them to school, put them in my purple bin. You can totally do that, okay? Um, if you have questions, let me know. But other than that, this is going to be kind of a fun, creative assignment. You guys have a lot of artistic freedom as to what you're going to be doing for this. And I'm really, really excited to see what you guys can come up with, okay? So again, I on your email, I will be attaching um, this uh, PowerPoint, or not PowerPoint, it's like a Word document um, with examples. You can always look up different examples online as well, okay? I miss you guys so much. Uh, my life is incomplete without you, and I hope you guys are all doing well. If you need extra clay or anything like that, 
feel free to come by school. Um, there are three bags of play outside as of Sunday evening. Um, so I need to buy some new bags to put them in because we're going through a lot of clay, which is awesome. So thank you. You guys rock. Um, and all those of you that are bringing projects to school to have me fire, that's awesome. I am, <clears throat> I'm not, I'm going to do a firing this week. Um, and then I'll let people know when they can come by and grab things. Okay. Um, okay, I guess I'm done talking now. Uh, love you, miss you, have a fantastic first week of May.